Hiya, folks. How's everyone doing? How are y'all doing today? I'm doing quite good. I see the chat is arguing about apple juice or orange juice. I'm gonna argue that it's gonna depend on the purpose because I normally prefer orange juice in my Kratom, but I would say if you're going for a drink to, or a, a, a juice to just like drink straight, I would say orange juice or I would say apple juice rather. So, although right now I'm rocking with a raspberry lemonade. Very fancy, very bougie. Becky, I don't know that I've ever noticed a difference between apple juice with or without concentrate. Hi, guys. I got Twitch alerts, not Discord pings. I've been, I, I forgot to keep checking if Discord has been sending out my, my live stream pings. So I'm glad you guys are here. Oh, I love white grape juice. Which one is the weak flavored one? I haven't been here in a while, though you may know me from the fact that I hate on certain names. I do recognize you, many mochi, and thank you for the bits. Very excited to show off my fancy little, um, my fancy little alert sounds, which are brand new. Very excited for those. Um, the stream yesterday really messed with me. I thought today was Wednesday. I am so sorry. Um, I am trying to up the number of days I stream per week as I'm sort of working towards quitting my day job and doing this shit full time. Wouldn't that be thrilling? God, I would love that. So. I figured I would I would come back and uh, give the people what they want, which is, as usual, Stevie the Monster Fuckers. Uh, you're right, Pretty Princess. I do vaguely remember most everyone. <laughs> I tend to interact with the chat a fair amount, so I will at least vaguely recognize the name. Not from Concentrate is Weaker. Interesting. Ooh, I do like lychee and boba. I will admit that. I got a new, uh, I got a new bro tank from Target today. It's very soft, very big really comfy. I feel hot. I feel very hot today. I'm gonna admit it. Oh, my hair's doing something over there. What is happening? What is happening? There we go. Okay. Becky, you don't get to frown on boba. You just had bad boba last time. I need you to admit it. Yeah, Crocky, I do recognize you always. Watermelon juice is good with Sprite. Ooh, I've never had that. That's not stellar. So... Why don't we get down to business with the monsters? Oh, also, don't forget, episode three of Gender Swap Podcast, which is my podcast with my trans older sister, uh, is available uh, on Spotify and on SoundCloud. So if you hit the podcast command in chat, I am going to show you what that looks like. Bah, there you go. Nerd Legacy beat me to it. Uh, you can hit that link, takes you to my website, shows you where you can subscribe to our Patreon, where you can listen to it, where you can follow us on Twitter. Holy shit. Hey, thank you for subscribing, Marvel. Thanks so much, bestie. So excited that I got to hear that alert today. Um, oh, and someone's hosting me. This is great. Um, not your sister hosting the glasses I bought you. Do, 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 do. That's the first time someone's hosted me since I got my new my new alerts. This is thrilling. Um, yeah, no, Becky, I was deeply pressed about it. <laughs> um, I personally love those glasses, so I don't want you to take any kind of offense to that. So, I digress. Um, I'm gonna go over the roster today. These are the hot and sexy monsters. I believe we have 20 to 22 on here for today. So, for those of you who are new, I'm gonna go over the tiers real quick just to let you know sort of what we're working with. Tier 0, unfuckable or illegal. Tier 1 means if you even look at me, I will take both of us out. Tier 2 is I literally don't even want to consider it, I'm gonna bomb. And tier three is bro, stop, you what the fuck. So three and below means I don't want to fuck you, but the lower below three you get, it means just how much I don't want to fuck you and how much bodily harm I will do if you want to fuck me. Um, four is vaguest amount of intrigue here, but I don't want to admit it. Um, five is, okay, wait, and now we're really getting into it. This middle tier is bestie, so this is for ones that we wouldn't fuck, but we don't want to, like, damn them to hell, you know what I mean? These are ones who, like, we would absolutely be tight with, but we would not fuck. Um, tier 6 is if you gave me a coy look from across the cafeteria, I'd blush. So, from here on up, we're interested, and from here on up, it's just how interested are we. Tier 7 is I would go out of my way to get your number, so I'm pursuing you now. Tier 8 is this is getting unhealthy, all I do is write fanfic about us all day long. Tier 9, I would let you ruin my life if it meant we got to make out. And tier 10, of course, is oh god, oh god, yes, let me get in there. So, 
time to scoot on over to our little shut the fuck up. There we go. Time to scoot over to our uh, our sexy little list. Can I close that? There we go. We're still in the dial tone category. I changed it before I went live, and Twitch just does not care for me even a little bit. Edit stream info. God damn it. Okay, at least it did change the title. Thank you for pointing that out, by the way. We will be going back to Dial Town later this evening, but I was really missing uh, Sadamath. Decided to come on back. Stevie Ray Jerry in the ticket phone booth. Listen, within the lore of the game, I feel like all those people are still considered human. They just all got their heads replaced. Deeply confusing. I digress. You should consider writing characters from dating sims you've played. I would love to do like a playoffs round of like all the highest rated monsters. I was looking through that list today and there is an embarrassing number of League of Legends characters. Like, like it's bad. It's, League has the hottest characters. I'm so sorry. Okay, so I'm gonna get started. As you can see from the little banners, I have the, the rules. So 500 bits or a sub means that I will rate your monster crush right then, right there. And if we get a hype train go, that's the wrong way. There we go. I forgot the camera's reversed. If we get a hype train going, I will be rating monsters straight from the chat. Um, so I see we've already got some bits. We've already got some uh, some subs. It's not our fault lead characters are sexy. No, you're right. Honest to God, you're right. I do like Monster Prom. I have played it before. And of course, I went for the hot demon boy. Um, and I think my friend Shy, who's one of my mods actually, uh, Monster Camp. Yeah, they played Monster Camp, and that seemed really fun. 69 viewers. Nice. Nice. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and get right into it. Uh, if ever a hype train starts, I will be taking monsters from the chat. But if you just can't wait, go ahead and drop some bits or a sub, and I will rate your monster right then and there. I am super excited. Okay. Thank you for doing me voice check. I'm going to try and be... I'm going to try and be careful to keep my voice in my lower register, because when I get excited, it tends to go up higher. So... First up is Hank from Madness Combat. I want to show y'all this sexy guy. Like, this isn't what he actually looks like in the game, I believe. He's so... Okay, okay. I don't consider him a human because he's been killed and revived so many times and survived his jaw getting ripped off, but he is the epitome of tech wear and says meme like Mimi, so I'd let him throw me in a blender. Oh yeah, he got <laughs> excited by a giant blender one time. So the actual character is just a very little guy. Oh my god, he does look like the Reddit logo. Yeah, some of these characters look fucking horrible. See, he's he's just a little guy. Like, he's deadass, just a little creature. Um, but the artwork is kind of is kind of cute. Like, I can see how people would be intrigued. Um, I don't know how... See, the problem is that I have a hard time rating characters based on the fan the fan art because the actual character looks nothing like that. Yeah, it's just a dude, but he's got a fun outfit and he did get his jaw ripped off, which, I mean, to be fair, I feel like you can still survive. Uh, well, he's been killed and revived, so I feel like he is somewhere above human. Hmm. You got this, Luke. Oh, hell yeah, you're transitioning, dude. Me too. Fuck yeah, we're twinning. That's thrilling. I'm so excited for you, my guy. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, Luke. Fuck it up, my guy. He's an amputee, not a monster. Okay, word. Okay, Becky gets it. He's hot, but not monstery enough. I know a friend of mine has a huge crush on the clown. I think I've rated the clown, the green bitch. He is one ugly motherfucker. Oh, he is ugly. Fan art shouldn't count, which is why you're rethinking Bill from Gravity Falls. No, you're right. You're right. You're right. I really can't rate him very high, if at all. Uh, where is he? There he is. Uh, I don't know if he even counts. So he's just survived a couple Saw movies. <laughs> yeah, Biblio gets it. Ah. Can I even rate him? I'll, I'll rate him. I'll rate him. I'll rate him. Um, would he be friends? I feel like he does a lot of murder. I, eh. Yeah, I don't know, man. I just gotta sit him at a three. I feel comfortable with him there. Eh. I don't know if I can really rate him much higher in good conscience. Although I do sense that people will be angry with me for this. 
Would he be a bestie? I don't know if I want- I don't know if I trust this man enough to be a bestie is the problem. <laughs> but is it, man, the real monster? King or your fucking mind. Your mind. Incredible. <laughs> Uh, I don't really want to be a bestie with him. I don't trust him. I don't know why, but I don't trust him. Moving on. Okay, so this one... This one's a little bullshit, but I've been waiting to rate it for ages. I've been waiting for the right moment, and I felt like now was really the time. So this next one is a song, which I haven't done since <laughs> that Daft Punk song from, like, three months ago. So Turn the Lights Off by Tally Hall person says, I'm sorry it's not a character, but this song has big monster fucking energy, and I wanted to do naughty things to be behind the abandoned Kmart. And something about that description is so compelling to me. So fascinating. Since I sub, can you rate Ralph from Rise of uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? Oh, yes. I will absolutely rate that bad boy. Um, the live action, let me see. Let me see. Ralph... Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles live action. I think I have rated them, and I'm not even gonna lie, that was at the beginning of my Monster Hunter journey, and I think I am more attracted to them now. Okay, so... <laughs> <laughs> it's this bitch, right? I'll do his full name just in case. Raphael. There he is. Okay, he's a little sexy. Like... See, the problem is that I kind of get it now. At the beginning of my monster fucker journey, I did not. He's a little sexy. <laughs> well... Come on. I don't like the texture turtle shells. You don't have to touch it. You don't have to touch it while you're at it, Becky. You don't. I mean, come on. I... Yes. I have... I have reviewed the available information. No, Nerd Legacies... Nerd Legacy gets it. Yeah. No, I have reviewed the available information, um, and I had decided that I would. I am going to have to update their score. I'm going to make a note of the guest stars. Oh, this is embarrassing. Yeah, I do be loving his personality. He got them anger issues. Does he? Becky, I know we've talked about you being attracted to evil, but are you attracted to anger issues? Because that is concerning. That worries me a little, bestie. Teenage Mutant Needle Teetles. My fuck. Oh Christ, how high would I rate this motherfucker? He's a little sexy. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Hi Barb, I... Someone subs, so I'm re-rating Raphael from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Okay, Biblio wants the voice. Unfortunately, yeah, I like anger, anger issues, but I get a fist fight anger issues, not punch drywall. Okay, okay, I think I see what you're saying. Came at the wrong time. No, not that kind of live. God damn it. What was this? 2018? When did that fucking movie come out? 2018? I'm just guessing right now. No. Mm. I know, I know. What year did the live action movie come out? Society was seen as a crisis over a hot turtle. Do I look up live action? 2014. Okay, I'll look up 2014. Ah, there we go, there we go, there we go. Okay. I sure hope this has the has his lines in it. Hold on, hold on.
God damn it. Boy, this is quiet. Give me a sec. I'm gonna crank this. We're ninjas or mutants. I think that was him. Well, technically we're turtles. Not you. Where's the red oh, one? And we're teenagers. Give me the red. We can still have. He's a teenage. Adult conversations. Uh. Oh, is that Megan Fox? I'm a snapping turtle, fool. Snap, slip, rap. Fun. I meant to do that. Oh, come on. I meant to do it. He's kind of like a little puppy dog. Inside the shell at all times. Dry, you're a talking turtle. And you're a human nerd. Now that we got that out of the way, hit it. You are about to get shell. You are about to get shell. Uh, can anyone else see that? That's my thing. I'm gonna hold him down forever. Also, I'm a world weak about a whole ever. I mean, hold on. Dry. You're a talking turtle. And you're a human nerd. Now that we got that out of the way, hit it. Oh, come on. This just isn't fair. Listen. Listen. I... I do take... This fucking music. I do take issue with the fact that teenage is in the name. So for that reason, I will not raise their rating. I d I'm not even I'm not even gonna risk it. I'm not even gonna risk it. No, no, I shall not risk this fucking music. God damn it! Listen, y'all are giving me a bunch of different a, d a bunch of different numbers, and I'm not I'm not I'm not risking shit. Mm mm. Continuing. Oh shit! I was about to listen to fucking Tally Hall. But uh. Bada, ba, bada, 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 ba, bada. Thank you for redeeming Hydrate Zone, Barb. Thank you very much. Ba, 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 bada, bada. Boy, I'm gonna get copyright claimed if I play this goddamn Tally Hall song. Oh, this song. You become one. Deputy teacher. Monster party. Eyes of yellow. Scales and feathers. Tails and This one. Oh, yes. Delightful. Delightful. This is a fun song. I'll admit it. I do not quite understand. There are, there are monsters in the actual, um, like in the actual video, which is good. But I don't necessarily. <sighs> hmm. I would definitely, like, be besties with that song, but I don't know. Hmm. Thank you for posture check. Thank you, because God knows I need it. Christ God. How much do they got to donate if you do the monster again? Uh, 500 bits, one sub, or $5. That is the equivalent. It's in the little purple box. Little purple doodad. So I'm only going to be taking requests from the chat when a hype train's going. Um, I think I want to be besties with this song. Like, I would get lunch with it, but I don't think I would necessarily fuck it. And I definitely do not get the feral energy that they were describing. Oh, oh, I forgot about the alert. <laughs> um, what if some hypothetically submitted never going to give you up? I would not rate it. So, <laughs> I, do, I do not think I would rate it. Oh, this one's great. Okay. So next up is, is uh, God of Death from a Brazilian RPG campaign on Twitch. Here's the thing. If any of you know what this fucker is from, like what the actual title is, please, please tell me. Because I don't like not knowing the actual title. So here is the boy. Hi, Zach. Oh, this bitch is sexy. Come on. 
couldn't rate. Never gonna give you a good copyright strike. Oh, they they got me before. They have already gotten me before. Oh shit. Hey Stevie, just hopped up. I don't know if you're rating any donation monsters. Hey, Stevie, I am. I just hopped up IDK. If you're rating any donation monsters, but I have a huge crush on Ram, a monster type guy from a video game called Paladins. Okay, Ram from Paladins. Let me see. <gasps> That was thrilling. That was delightful. Okay. Nope, that is not what I meant to do. That's on me. Okay, images, ROM. Have I done this bitch before? This looks very familiar. No, Zach, I actually haven't gone to yours yet. Thank you for reminding me. Um, This is a guy who looks like he's got a gun for a dick. That's this guy. Yeah. <laughs> He's fun. That's a big ass gun. Oh, it's on his arm. Have I raided him before? Hold on. Let me check. Also, for those of you who don't know, this is my website. You can go to the Monster Fuckers page and check and see if I've ever uh, raided something before. I ha I gave Rom from Paladins a 10? Why did I do that? I've got to I've got to listen to the voice cuz I I know something went on with the voice to make me rate it that high. I fucking know it. Something happened. Something happened here. All ultimate voice lines paladins rom I'm a little confused by these titles. I am at least gonna go to YouTube and see. Just that hot, I guess. No, honestly, like, what the fuck happened here? No, pause it. Okay. Paladin's voice lines. After you see a couple of monsters you're horny for, it sort of spills over. No, honestly, you're right. Okay. 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 Fine. Okay. <laughs> Fucking it. Fuck. 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 That's enough. That's enough. That's enough. It's always growly voices. Always. Always. When will it stop? At what point will it stop? When? <sighs> yeah, so I think that's why I rated it a 10 last time. I think I was probably already worked up and then the girl got me. Thank you for redeeming Hydrate Zone. Stevie, I made a mistake. The voice. Are you sure? Thank you for the bits, my friend. I'm worked up now. <laughs> Christ, God. I cannot imagine being able to know and rate your cousin's monster type, but if you'd fuck them, it feels like you go to your aunt who acts as for a Brazilian. Christ, God. Uh, yeah, no, Zach, you do. Listen, Zach, we know too much about each other. We, c well, no. To be fair, my extended family, or rather our extended family, already knows all the blackmailable shit about me. I could ruin your shit, as it turns out. That's a joke, Twitch gods. My cousin and I are on good terms. So. Um. Da -da -da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da. I was rating this hot ass motherfucker. Okay, so they said he's a paranormal monster that can control time. His introduction is very epic. I can't lie that I think he's hot because he's buff. Listen. He's buff. He's got a skull for a head. He's got some kind of glowy thing going on here. I think that's fun. He is literally death personified, and I just think that's a- He's got big ass hands. You know, I think that's fun. When you get too up close to the flesh, it starts to get a little creepy. Are those tentacles or just flames? I really can't tell, but I'm into it either way. I think this is fun. I think he's really fun. <laughs> Your everyday weirder goes big. 
No, you're right. You're right, and you should say it. Um, he's hot. He's hot, you know? Um, oh, yeah, he's definitely tall. I think he's great. Um, they didn't give me the title of the RPG. <sighs> so, unfortunately, I cannot rate the introduction. I can't really hear the voice, anything like that. Yeah, he's got them big-ass hands. Um, thank you for the voice check. Um, oh, those are, those are, those are choking hands. Um, now, wait a damn minute. Are those chains? Those are He is strapped the fuck up. He just has those bad boys on him. Like, he is just... Oh! That's delightful. Delightful. Done the research, assuming every show or movie takes place here at release. Raph is generally 15 at the start of the series, making him at most 20 by the time it... Ah, I see, I see, I see. Um, those are punching in the face hands. Chains? Honestly. Um, 500. There's a little bit... That there we go. The little purple banner has you, has the, the details. Reverse image searching is a good idea. Hold on. Wait. I forgot I have that app. Oh, my sister texted me. Y'all. My sister has a Redbubble account. Not the one on the Gender Swap podcast. Different sister. And her username is the Ginger Dragon. So if you want to go on Red on uh, Redbubble and get some shit. That's... I just put it in the chat. The Ginger Dragon. Um... Ba -da -da, ba -da -da, ba -ba -da -ba -da, ba -ba Sorry, I got distracted. I was gonna reverse image search this. Yeah, Hannah has a red bubble. It's really cute. It is really cute. Okay. Deus de morte. Okay, God of Death. Well, I know that much. Continue. Okay, O S N F. I am going to look up Deus. De morte OSNF. What is that? What is that? <laughs> he looks like he's a flat ass. Don't be mean. Ordem paranormal. Please translate. Ah! There we go. OSNF. Great. Okay. Okay, there we go. Now we're talking. Order paranormal fandom. Okay. Yeah, this is in Portuguese. Okay, there we go, there we go. Um, okay, so paranormal order. Great. I'm going to make a note of that. Paranormal order. Sick. I'm really glad to actually know it now. Um, thank you to whoever suggested reverse image searching. That was very smart. Thank you for the bits, bestie. Um, is this, hey, enough, is for this enough for a monster crush review? It is. If not, then ignore this and enjoy the bits. If it is, then could you do Emperor Doviculus from Brutal Legend? Oh, yes. His voice is so nice. Emperor Doviculus. Honestly, I'm surprised that the, the bot was able to pronounce that. From Brutal Legend. Oh, also, what am I going to rate the God of Death? He's going to get rated pretty high. Um, I, mm, he does have a very little head. He, that is his only downfall. I will say, I feel like he has a very little head. Yes, real money donations are still just as good. I just couldn't fit it on there. Uh, but yeah, 500 bits or $5 or one sub. It's all equal. Um, he might not reverse bobblehead. That's really funny. I might put him at a six. Well, he's still very big. No, Eggman is a human being, but the one in the live action Sonic movie, Jim Carrey with the fancy hair and the sexy ass mustache. Yes, absolutely. God, I want to fuck that man. Okay, I'm putting the God of Death at a seven and now I'm going to rate that donation one. Let's see what that bad boy looks like. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Tim Curry? Oh my god. Oh my god. It's a Tim Curry. I love him. How do I ask my grandma for a couple dollars so I can get my cousin to rate a monster and how badly he wants to fuck it? <laughs> Family gets rated for free, Zach. You know this. Who is this? Oh! Oh, this is fun. I need to listen to this bad boy's voice. Da, 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 da. Except for his decapitation. That's that's kind of them. 
I fucking love Tim Curry. I'm so excited. I'm already horny. This is thrilling. This is thrilling. Oh my god. Your master calls. Serve by my side. Think of none other but me. Move as you are told. Die for beauty. Ah! Your pain. Delicious. My no! Pain. No! No! <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I. He. He's just... Y'all know what line I'm backing it up for. For beauty. More pain. Delicious. <laughs> my, oh my friends God. have let me down again. Ah, these nuns are extra blessed. Oh! Back up okay. this sad puppet show. Okay, come on. Come on. Holy shit. Wow, this guy is so sexy. No, I want a timestamp for this quote. You made her into a little monster. Now let me show you how to make a big one. Fucking Christ. I will beat this thing down myself if... Oh my god, no, Kingor, you're right. God damn it. I get... I. For someone who makes their living by being horny on the internet, I get so embarrassed every time someone points out the corruption thing, the defiling thing. I'm like, no, don't. Don't look at me. Like, girl, you're in too deep now. You're in far too deep now. Can't take it back. Everyone knows. <laughs> oh, my God. This man. Come on. Holy shit. His fucking voice. He's got a weird ass face, though. <laughs> Y'all have to admit, he's got a weird fucking face. Well. Well. Those look like. F That's adorable. It's fucking guitars. I mean. I <sighs> if I have to, silence. Die with dignity. Okay, I don't girly. want to kill you, but I just don't think you cut it as my slaves. Uh. Are you just looking for a free amputation? You call yourselves demons? You look like you'll bleed profusely. Hello, soggy puppets. His fucking lines are so funny. Oh my god. I, I, I'm in love with this man. Christ god, I love Tim Curry. Oh my god. I have so much gender envy for Tim Curry. Uh, puppets. He said... He, he said soggy puppets. He did. Yeah. God, that's hot. Oh. That's the voice from the Rat King from Barbie Nutcracker. Tim Curry? Are you just fucking with me? <laughs> he said what he said. <laughs> Christ God. Ugh, this man is hot. Come on. <gasps> Thank you, friend. One hey, sec. Dude. Submitting Takinam from Chaotic. Specifically, the red version of her before the show's art change. She's the reason for my crippling tiefling addiction in DND, and there's a pic of her on Google just cracking her knuckles that makes me melt. <laughs> you know I'm excited for that bad boy. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, how high should I rate Emperor Diviculus? All I can think of is actual Tim Curry's face. I don't find him hot at all. Listen, I think about uh, when he was in Clue, and I did find him hot in that. I very much found him hot in that. Like, come on. Um, Christ, I was obsessed with that movie for a while, and it was definitely just because I wanted to bang Tim Curry. 
Yeah. Oh, Daviculus is getting like a nine. Like that's like a whole nine. God, that man is so attractive. Um, okay, who is next? Ah, this bitch. Talking to him from Chaotic. Okay, okay, girly. The red version of her before the show's art change. Chaotic. I don't know if adding red will help, but oh, okay. Word. Fun. Oh, she's pretty. Oh, she's pretty. I don't know if I'm looking at the right ones. I think I have done Gangorka. I'm pretty sure I have actually. Um, am I looking at the right ones? Oh, well, that's different. Um, she's very pretty though. If I'm looking at the right one, she is extremely pretty. Um, crippling tiefling addiction. Um, she's really hot, dude. Okay, I can absolutely see where the appeal for this one comes in. Hmm. No, she's got big ass hands, cinched ass waist, wings. Yes. Um, the pick I was thinking of if you just search her name. Yeah, no, she's hot. Okay. Um, I think this is gonna be at least a seven. I would go out of my way to get her number. I don't know if I'm writing insane amounts of fanfic. I do feel about equally about her and this god of death. So I'm gonna put her at a set that should not have done that. <laughs> I'm gonna put that at a seven. Yeah, the submissions are rating high. Like y'all submissions are rating extremely high. Um, no, Barb, you're right. I've rated I think over over a hundred. Over a hundred at this point. <laughs> Uh, another monster I'd love to it's see rated again, would be the sir. final boss. Another monster I'll love to see rated would be the final boss from Devil May Cry 4. Final boss, Devil May Cry 4. Do you know its name? Because I don't know how accurate. Who are y'all talking about? Do y'all know? That's just people who are mad about it. The savior, the savior, thank you. Devil May Cry, the savior. Wait! Wait! He's smooth as a Ken doll down there. At least he's in pants. I don't think he's in pants, I think he just looks like that. Um, he's a little bit hot, big statue. He does look like a Grecian statue come to life. Um, does he have a voice by any chance? He's got hands in the mouth, no. Nah, you're right. You're right, dude. Um, oh. I get so excited with some follows because that one takes, that one, that one always takes me aback. Um, you said kinda. Okay, if you only kinda has a voice, I'm not compelled. But, I am very intrigued. Thank you for the voice check. Um, this guy's a little bit hot. He does look very tall. <laughs> How big he <laughs> Let's go see Becky. Um, gargantuan statue. Well, they said it's gargantuan. I feel like it's pretty big. The difference between the savior and the false savior. The actual final boss. Interesting. So it says it's a gargantuan statue. If that helps. Oh, the main antagonist bounds with him, which gives him a voice. Okay, okay, I see. I mean, I am interested, but let me see how much. I can't really tell what's happening in this picture. <laughs> Word. Interesting, interesting. Savior.
I'm thinking this is gonna be at least above five. Um, if this bad boy winked at me from across the cafeteria, gargantuan more like fuck me. <laughs> no, you're at this little guy's face in the corner. <laughs> I can't focus on this man with him watching me. I am interested though. I think this is probably gonna be a six. <sighs> yes, I have reviewed. I've mentally reviewed. This is gonna be a six. I don't know that I would go out of my way to get its number, but I would at least kind of like blush a little bit uh, if he did give me, you know, a look, so. That's that one. Um, I'm going to go back to the top of the list. Don't forget, uh, everybody watching, you can get a monster rated with 500 bits or a sub or five bucks. Um, but once a hype train is going, I will be taking suggestions straight from the chat. Um, so I think subs are the quickest way to get a hype train going. I can never remember how it actually works. Um, I think you can end up doing about one per hour, if I remember correctly. So... Uh, if you really, really want to get a, want to get your monster rated, but don't want to donate directly, let's just hope a hype trade gets going, and I'll be taking suggestions straight from the chat. So, oh, hell yeah. <laughs> I love that alert so much! No one's asked you for any of the legit demons in the franchise, so I am gonna have to ask for the imps from Doom. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. The sequel version is a little bit more protruding bone, a bit more doomsday, but I'd be lying if I said I wouldn't still hit it. Okay, imps from Doom. I deadass forgot that that was the alert I set for that one. I need y'all to just anticipate me like happy stimming every time I hear my alerts because it makes me so fucking happy. That one especially when I first heard it. Ah, I love you so much. <laughs> it's just it's so good. Thank you for the gift sub, Sonya. Oh my god, thank you. Um, let me know in the chat, Sonya, if you want another monster rated. And if not, you can pay it forward to somebody else. Um, I do not like this. Yeah. King Or, I respect your opinion so much. I do not like this. At all. The mouth is deeply distressing. It looks like his body is inside out. Like, it looks like the muscle is on out is on the outside. I... Ugh. That's a lot. They do look very fleshy. I don't trust this man even a little bit. That's a fucked up and. <laughs> I'm mad that sent me so fucking hard. Mandibles ain't hot. No, exactly. Teeth can be, but mandibles not so much. And they hated him for he told them the truth. I am very sorry, my ever suffering martyr Kangor, but alas. I am not interested in the fucking mandible boy. <laughs> what was that? Fuck yeah. Again, this is from Devil May Cry lore. Sparta in his demon form. Anything for you. Anything for you, Sonya. Okay, Doom. Um, I would literally kill one of these if it came on to me. That is a that is a hard one. And you know I hate to do that. You know I hate to rate something so low. Fucking hate it. It's ugly as hell. Um, very ugly. Very bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, okay, Sparta, demon form, devil may cry. Ants are so fucking scared, they're my biggest fear. Oh, god, I hate cow ants so much. Okay, wait. Wait, so this guy... I mean, he looks big. He looks big and murdery. I'm very into this. I love the horns. I love the armor. I love kind of the mask thing. Oh, come on. I love this. Thank you for subscribing, Golden. Thank you so much. Hi, bestie. I'm so, so happy that you are resubscribing. If you would like a monster rated, let me know in the chat what you would like. Oh, he, he absolutely is a demon daddy. 
I love this man. I am very into this. Um, if he has a voice, let me know, but I think he's gonna get rated high either way. Also, this art is fucking gorgeous. Oh, where would I rate him? I think this is an eight. Good for him, he has two sons. Oh, that is absolutely a Dilf. Yes, that makes my heart happy. Um, no, not this one. It was, uh, I had to copy paste that. Technically, he's a grandpa, though. I'm very into this man. A gilf. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think this is an eight. I honestly think this is an eight. Um... Ah, oh, what a hottie. Okay, so I'm gonna go back to my regularly scheduled list. Um, you can donate or uh, start a hype train at any time, and then we get the request going. Um, don't be afraid to don't be afraid to interrupt me. As long as you choose our bangers. Thank you very much, my friend. Oh, delusions, you're absolutely correct. Oh my god, are you right? Oh! Yes, absolutely. CD, would you ever open a P.O. box so we can send you stuff? Yes, eventually. They're so expensive in my area, I'm not sure why. Um, one thing I have found is that on the Amazon wish list, if one thing from the wish list is in your cart, you can add other shit to the cart, and then it'll all be sent here. It's kind of confusing um so there I, there is like some cheaper stuff on there a lot of people have done it that way it's very confusing um but i am planning to properly open up a p.o box it's gonna get easier for y'all um but i am gonna move in about a month so i really can't keep doing the wish list thing the way i've been doing it i've been thinking about it so you know okay so next up uh is the bitch from just gives your home address so we can ship it there i see nothing wrong with this plan Thank you, Barb. You're absolutely right. I live on 123 Internet Street. Um, so, next up is the Black and Red Robots from Mitchell, Mitchell versus the Machines. I can see the appeal here. I can see, I can see the appeal. Um, I really... I love the angles. I think they're just very visually appealing. I don't know if I actually find them attractive but i f i really like visually it makes my brain happy you know what i'm saying mm. hmm. thank you for doing posture checks on yeah the struggle is i wanted to make something and send it to you oh that's so sweet nerd what the fuck that's so sweet no the spike would hurt you're absolutely right oh god Uh, stretch felt good. Yeah, I'm gonna put this at a um, four or five. Okay, wait, or vaguest amount of intrigue, but I don't want to admit it. Listen, I'll admit it. I just don't think it'll work out. I mean, it's really impractical. I, th I, yeah, no, there's not really any way that's gonna work once I think about it a little further. Um, so I will put these at a four. Vaguest amount of intrigue, but I don't want to admit it. Um, I said out loud to my roommate that I found them so hot. He can't understand it. I don't know why I find them attractive. Please help. No, honestly. Pointy robots. Oof, ouch, my bum. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Um. I don't remember the name currently, but there's a website designed for wishlist. You can add anything from any website on it with the URL, and it's safe for your info to get on the Amazon wishlist. The only downside is that you pay a slightly higher shipping fee. That sounds amazing. I think I, I think I've heard of that before, but for the life of me, I cannot remember what the name of the site is. If anyone remembers what it is, I would love to hear it because then I can start putting my shit on there because I don't always love having my shit on Amazon. Um, hi, Zach. Glad you're back, bestie. I'm going to rate those a four because I don't really know that they're fuckable, though I am vaguely intrigued. Prepare yourself for the Hydro check. Thank you very much.
Okay, next up is SCP-079 from the SCP Foundation. Um, I just feel like it would have a soft spot for me if we got to know each other a little, you know? I'll explain a bit. It's a sentient AI hard drive who's stuck on a little computer from the 70s and should have better software, but doesn't. It was made by a guy whose goal was to make an AI that improved itself over time, and then he forgot about SCP-079. So, the actual art is not that interesting, so I am gonna show y'all the fan art. Um, because, listen, the backstory was actually very compelling. What was it, 079? Very creepy. Very horrible. It's a, it is a computer. So, the problem... Oh, I don't like that. So, I really was not so concerned, like, with what the actual... I'm not so concerned with its backstory as I am, like, why they find it attractive. I love that they told me the backstory. But I hate that they told me nothing about why they find this computer AI, this old-ass computer, fuckable. Like, I really don't get it. I don't think it is fuckable, really. Um, that might just be a zero, because I literally don't think you can fuck a computer. Listen, someone out there someday is going to prove me wrong, and maybe it's you. But it won't be me. So for today, SCP-079 gets a zero. And that's that. Let me see. Things to get me dot com. Let me see. What was that? Oh, follow. Hell yeah, dude. This is thrilling. Hold on. I need to check on something. Give me a sec. Um I really hope that was the proper link, or else I just fucked my shit up, huh? Okay. Oh shit, I shouldn't have closed those. Are those okay? There we go, okay. Oh, I love this song. Yes, that was the one. Universal wish list. Perfect. Thank you so much, my friend. I appreciate you immensely. So I am not interested in this. This is a zero. Okay, I'm watching the stream at Bush Gardens because it's raining. Stay safe out there, Red. Love you, King. Um, so this next one is a Followers Friends OC. The creator is named, I think, Geodos, and they said that <laughs> they think she just keyboard smashes to make the name. But their OC is just named John, um, and they find him very attractive. And he was supposed to have shorts as well, but she forgot them. So, this is John. I really love it. Really can't see a lot of what's going on. Night, Bessie's Joy Horny Hours. Have a good night, Becky. Sleep well. I hope you have a good day at work tomorrow. And thank you for the bits. I adore you. I'm so sad I miss Becky already. Um, I think John is very sexy. Although, I, I feel like the, the dark green part looks like fancy little pants. So I really love the implication that this guy is just walking around butt-ass naked, but no one can tell because of the fur. I think that's fun. I just think that's great. Um, I do, I, I like the horns a lot. I am intrigued. Okay, I can kind of see the little, like the red eye. Although to be fair, I feel like I can't quite tell exactly what's going on here. Mr. Fancy Pants, exactly. Um, I am intrigued. I think this might be an okay wait. Um, not Donald Duck Syndrome. Christ God. Have a good night, Shiver Me Liver. That's a very fun username, by the way. I'm probably going to set this one at a five because I am intrigued, but I feel like I don't know enough about them um, to be raging horny for them. You know what I mean? Okay. You don't have to say it, but you're right. No, honestly, like, come on. So this bad boy is a five. Pantsless John. Pantsless John is a five because I am intrigued, but not raging horny. <gasps> Thank you, Sonya, for the gift sub. Shit. He is for sure facing that direction because the cock is out. <gasps> Holy shit. A hype train. <gasps> this is thrilling. Garnet for Steven Universe makes it go from being a top to a bottom in less than a second. 
Oh yeah, no, Ayo, Garnet is delightful. Garnet from Steven Universe. She makes me go from being a top to a bottom in less than a second. No, she is extremely hot. Honestly, I feel like I'd at least want to be besties with her. I feel like I can't imagine fucking her, but I want to be besties with her so bad, although she is very hot. Her voice is very hot. Anyway, get your free monsters. Barb is correct. Lucino from IDD. I believe I've actually did Lucino recently. Um, Zach Redeen, please, sir. Any spare subs? Any spare subs for Paul off and boy? Any at all? Listen, I'm gonna admit it. I do want to fuck Garnet from Steven Universe. I'll admit it. Just how much do I want to fuck her? Mmm. A seven. I would go out of my way to get her number. I would. Skeleton Man from Black Cauldron. Are you talking about Hexus? I think I've done him as well. Um, okay. Jam Mac from Kipo. Let me see what I'm working with. God damn it, not the fucking fish. Not the frog, man. I hate this fucking frog guy. He is so goddamn annoying. He is so annoying. I hate him so much. I hate this frog man so much. Fuck you. That's a 3 out of 10. That's a bro stop. You what the fuck. I misspoke, Barb. Fuck off. Nivon from DMC3. Okay, we got 3.5 minutes left. 88%. Oh. Well, she's just got her titties out, doesn't she? This is a green lady. Kind of. I'm not so sure. Yeah, so she seems fun, but she is basically a lady. Um, I would rate her mm, at like a five, honestly, just because I'm not totally sure if she counts. Sorry. Another monster from a Mexican movie. Another monster, movie. this one is from a Mexican movie called La Leyenda de la Nawala, and it's the Nawala in her final Ooh. form. She would be a toxic mama. Not a toxic mama. Yeah, no, I feel like the human green lady is not necessarily monstrous enough. Okay, two and a half minutes left on the hype train. If we want the free suggestions to keep going, we gotta get to the next level. Is it this bitch? Is it her? Which one of these bitches is it? Hmm. Let me know which one it is, because I am interested. Chernabog from Fantasia. The final form. This? I really hope you don't mean that. What? That? I don't love what's going on here. I don't. Daddy Deers from Friday Night Funkin' is far too human for me. Okay, this bitch is a little bit hot. He reminds me of Hexus. He's muscly. He's He's got the horns. He's got the wings. I think he's sexy. I think he's sexy. Listen, I think he's delightful. Um, Big and evil. I love him. I'm intrigued. I feel like he would humiliate me. Um, Horn King from the Black Cauldron. Is that not... Hold on. Horn King, Black Cauldron. Him? Bitch, what the fuck? What the fuck? Ooh, we got one minute left in the hype train, y'all. Sub bits or gift subs. We'll get us to the next level and we can keep on going for five more minutes. This bitch is not appealing even a little bit. Ah, I hate that. I really, really hate that. I don't like that motherfucker. No, that's a solid two. I would, I would literally start a fight if he wanted to get onto me. Um, ba -da -ba -ba. okay, Demon Mama from Beowulf. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. I feel like this isn't right. <laughs> Is this correct? I don't even know which one of these to. Well. One of those had... Uh, thank you for the gift sub. Um, one of those had, um, kind of titties on it. So I am, um, I'm hoping that just didn't get caught. So, uh, um, <laughs> thank you, SimSim, for the gift sub. Uh, if you would like me to rate one of your monsters, SimSim, let me know. Um, uh, OC Chanel 
Haro in her monster form. OC Chanel Haro in her monster form. Show me. You can drop that in the media channel on Discord if you're in our Discord server, and I would love to see that bad boy. Um, I have rated Lemon Demon. I'm not into him very much, and I really want to be, but I'm not. Um, Electro Fatui Guard. Please let me do from Genshin Impact. What is that? I get so many Genshin Impact recommendations. Oh, she's cute. She's fun. Hey, is this not a human? This just looks like a human. Which... So which one am I supposed to be working with? Because I feel like you're talking about one of these. They're very little and I don't love that. Yeah, that doesn't look like a monster. That just looks like a human and kind of Lolita, which I really don't fuck with. Um, the nurse from Silent Hill. Let me see. No! Oh, God. Ah, that gives me heebie-jeebies. You fucked up. If you gave me heebie-jeebies, you fucked up. I don't like it. That gives me a lot of body horror. That's gross. That's gross. That's gross. I don't like that. Anyway, Artemis from DMC5. Oh! Okay, girly. You know, I am interested. She's very pointy. She's very pointy. Like, like I'm not 100% sure what's going on here, but I'm very interested. I am interested. I feel like she's got weight. Now that, yes, yeah, yeah. No, I, I can see the appeal now. It looks like she has a mermaid tail at the end and also centipedes for arms, which isn't ideal, but I think it's fun. Um, two and a half minutes left on the hype train. We're at 28%. Um, I think she's pretty sexy. I'm going to give her mm, like a seven. I am. Oh, I'm very scared of her. I, I'm very, very scared of her. I feel like she would kill me. Um, oh, I'm so upset. But Beetlejuice from the musical is hot. Listen, listen. He looks like a dude in this, so I'm not even going to be able to rate him, really. But this is just me, like, person to person, not monster fucker to monster fucker. And something about this bitch's voice is so hot, and I can't explain it. It is horrifying. It's fucking horrifying. Same goes for Beetlejuice in the movie. He is fucking nasty and awful. He sucks so bad, but he's very hot. Um, okay. I'm scrolling back up through the chat to see if I missed anything in particular. Um, Dark Deception's Murder Monkeys. You know, I really don't like the way that sounds. Dark Deception, Murder, Monkey. Oh, I'm already scared. No! No! That's a monkey, and it has blood, and that sucks ass. Megara from Hades is so hot, but I would not qualify her as a monster. Ah, oh, she's so hot. She's so fucking hot. Oh my god. There's so much good content of Megara and, and Zag together. Ah! It's so good. It's so good. Um, anyway. I'm acting up. We got one more minute left, so put these bad boys in the chat. Holy shit! 20 bucks, King, are you fucking kidding me? My truth when unheard, I bring devilish option. <sighs> Want a strong demon? Doom? Tyrant? More of a blade scum? Oh my god. The night is for you. Into skinny white boys? The arch hole has gaslight and- That is bat shit that you donated $20. Yes, I will rate all of those for you. I am going to rate Mountain Lions first. Ichabod from No Evil. What am I looking at here? Hey, Bestie, what am I looking at? Mini animated series. His main form is a crane. I'm assuming you mean this bitch? Oh, he's cute. I feel like I want to be besties with him, though. I don't necessarily want to fuck him. Um, he does seem delightful. Yeah, Cerberus is a dog, so I am not going to be raiding that. I would be besties with Cerberus, though. Okay, what were the ones Kingor put? Also, thank you so much for the donation, Kingor. What the fuck? Thank you guys for the hype trade. The hype trade just ended. I am so, so grateful to all of you. This is delightful. Oh, I got a moat. Hold on, hold on. Oh, these are fun. Is that a lizard? Oh, that's a dog. Look at him. He's very little. That's very good. Um, okay, okay. 
already uploaded her. Okay, Sonya, I'm gonna go take a look. I'm so excited. Hold on. Where did it go? Hold on, I'm gonna just bust open Discord. Thank you for redeeming Hydrate Zone. Let me see. No, no, that's my channel. That's my channel. That's my channel with my mods. Keep out. Keep out. <laughs> General media. There we go. Ba, 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 ba. Oh! Uh, you know, it is sideways, but I am very interested. Now, hold on. Can I not rotate this? No, I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna get this if I have to. Hold on. Open file. Rotate. Okay, come on. That's so sexy. That's unbelievably sexy. You did such a good job. You did such a good job. I love this very much. This is at least a seven. No, I would ask this bad boy for their number. This is very, very good. Um, uh, my love, the love of my life. This is so fucking good. Thank you for recommending that. I do love rating people's OCs. Okay, so King Or, I'm going to rate yours now. Okay, uh, because I truth when I'm to bring devilish options. Doom's Tyrant. She's 321 years old and she's, she's pan. She's 321 years and she's pan. Three. That's very powerful. Hey, King Or. This looks like a hammerhead shark and you know it. This. This doesn't even look like so, that. His whole guts is out. His whole guts is out. What the fuck is this? He's got a big ass hand and he's got a battery over here. Fuck off. No. 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 He looks, that leg looks like an uncircumcised dick. You want a penis leg? You want a fucking penis leg? With a hoof coming out of it? No, fuck you. No. They're horns, he's a cyborg. No. Nasty. He looks nasty. Okay, Dread Knight is next. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just tearing you a new one. <laughs> I really am. Okay, Dread Knight. Is that also from... Okay, so that's from Warhammer. Okay, okay, let me see. This I'm intrigued by. This is fun. You seem to go for the nasty, like, fleshy-looking ones. You go for a mix of, like, weirdly fleshy and, like, robotic. Which I'm trying so hard to understand. They're all Doom. Okay, so this is Doom. So, you are combining, like, naked pulsating muscle and flesh and, like, car parts, and you're calling it a hot monster crush? And I think that's a personality flaw, personally. Cyborg, cyborgs are neat. No, that just looks nasty. This is not it for me. Um, I am not, I'm, yeah. Val, if you're looking for the list, you should be able to go on the website, give me a sec. You should be able to go on the website and hit the monster fuckers link up there, and then that'll get you right to the list. Um, I'm sorry, I would also rate this like a two. I would start a fight if it tried to come on to me. Um, into skinny white boys, the arch vial has gaslight energy. I'm very excited. Arch vial from Doom. What am I working with here? That is on fire. That looks like a bitch from Star Wars. Doom Eternal's hipster arch vial. Um, every single image of this so far has looked different. So I really cannot get a read on it. Naked pulsating flesh and untire and unrelenting metal. I... Every single image of this bad boy looks different. 
I cannot get a read on it. Why do you look like that? Why does he look like that? Why does he look like that? Oh my god. I am not exceptionally attractive. I am sensing a theme. They all have like weird mouths and fleshy faces. Concept from Art of Doom Eternal is the hottest. Okay, Archville. Concept Art of Doom. E That's not how you spell that. Eternal. Ooh. Oh, these are cool. No, that, that art style is very cool. Um, what just happened? Hey, Val! Thank you for the gift sub. Holy shit. If you'd like me to rate a monster of yours, let me know, bestie. Um, and what else? What was the last one? The Marauder if you're a coward. Well, I'm personally very excited to see what the Marauder's deal is. So. This is more my speed. Have I done this one before? No. This looks more like what I tend to go for. You know? This is hot. I like the horns. I don't love the skeleton head, but I do like the armor. Okay, cutie. He's having fun. I think he's I think he's fun. He's still kind of got a fucked up mouth, but I do like the horns. So I'm gonna rate this at like, um, I'm gonna rate this a six. If it flirted with me, I would flirt back, you know? I would, I definitely would. Fine, the coward option it is. It's just gonna get the highest goddamn rating. No, you're right. Oi. Also, there's the corruption spreading out for the chest plate. Promise? No, that's hot. You know that. Okay. So. Val gets to suggest the next monster. Um, Sonya, I think I did yours already. That was your OC. I might be wrong. Um, oh, hell yeah. Thank you, Phantom, for resubscribing. Thanks, bestie. Let me know if you would like to uh, uh, have a monster rated as well. Beyond that, let me see. Ba -da 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 -da. Uh, oh, I should have, ah, oh, shit. I should have written down the ones from that King Or had. Downside, I hated almost all of them, which makes me feel really bad because I really like King Or. <laughs> That's not how you spell tyrant. God damn it. I used them to bleach my brain. My cousin said they were <laughs> Clippy. Wait, I think Clippy has been recommended before. I'm not even kidding. Pretty much all of them got twos until uh, the last one, which got a six, which I would like to apologize for. Archvile. Archvile, I'm going to give it three just for being a gaslighting king. Um, and the Marauder gets uh, a five, I believe it was. Was it a five or a six? No, it was a six because I would flirt back. I submit five, one gets a decent rating. No, you're right. Gave another sub. Discord from MLP is the next. You mean the fucking song? You mean like Discord? I'm having nothing. That one? That one? Or is this an actual character? Bitch, what the fuck? What is happening here? Well, what is ha what's happening here? What's going on? Um, he looks ugly as fuck, unfortunately. Even if he's like a Loki trickster god, he looks like he was just like smashed together and, and like put through a food processor. 
No, I do not really engage with like My Little Pony info, fandom. I never went through that phase. I avoided it. Ugh. Yes, I love this fucking song. My Little Pony. Um, that just gets a three, honestly. He makes me kind of mad. Oh, this song is great. Holy shit. I'm vibing very hard. New Donk City Festival. <laughs> okay. Maybe Soba, shut the fuck up. Listen. Ugh. This is so good. So regardless, alas, I am not interested in him. Um, but because y'all have gone absolutely fucking bonkers recommending these, I have hardly gotten through my list. Which I really can't complain about. Okay, so Phantom said he was trying to find the name of the monster. Um, my submission is the Moon Presence from Bloodborne. Jump up in the air. Andromeda from Mass Effect. I feel like I've done something like that before. Mass Effect. I have not. You're in luck. I have done some for Mass Effect. Okay. Moon Presence from Bloodborne and doesn't like Patrick Brilliant's basic response to cyborgs. <laughs> King or you're never going to stop giving me shit for that, huh? Okay. And Andro Excuse me, Andromeda Mass Oh, Andromeda. There we go. Well, I should have figured since it's from Bloodborne. I I, I just should have figured that it would have been an Eldritch Horror. So I'm literally just trying hard to like comprehend like where this is at, like what I'm looking at. See, this is hot. Okay. Ah, oh, hell yeah. Damn. Sonya's going bonkers and fucking yonkers on the gift subs. Um, this art kind of helps put it in perspective. So they're very big, and I could be in their hand, and I'm very into the size thing. He does have tentacles. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. I feel like a bit of good nature ripping is allowed if I'm calling the internet monster fucker dude vanilla. No, absolutely. No, you're right. The tentacles really are doing it for me, and also the size thing. This is going to get rated pretty high, I'd say. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. Moon presence. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Oh, yeah, no, Pretty Princess, that is old news. We knew that already. Let me see. That might be a six just because I am a little bit scared of it. But the size thing is really good. Also, this art in general is like really doing it for me. Yeah. This is an eight. This is getting unhealthy. All I do is write fanfic about us all day long. Absolutely. And Andromeda from Mass Effect. Wait. Wait. I fucking love the mask thing. God, that bitch is hot. How have I not rated this before? Have I really not ra- Okay, but like- This is really hot. I do love this. Ah, oh, this is great. Yes, um, I would fuck this. I would. Not gonna get much drama. Is also the name of the most recent game. Oh, gotcha. So is this not the character, or is this just the? I'm. A, is this the actual character? Am I getting the right one? Um. I do like this. Oh, it's a piglet. What the fuck? I have earbuds in. I just listened to you be horny while asking my grandma if I get my girlfriend's tomorrow. <laughs> Yeah. 
Eventually, one day, Stevie will run out of monsters, and there'll be a sad, sad day. You know, you'd think so, but there's 6,000 emails in my inbox that would say otherwise, so... Where the fuck is the pink dude? Character? Character? Like... Which one is Andromeda? Which one? Uh, otherwise, please drop it in, uh, media. In, uh, in Discord. Because otherwise I will not be able to find it, and I really want to rate it for you. Blue dude on the right. As in this bitch? As in the one with the cat head? This bitch? I actually do that sometimes, Biblio. I will, like, go through, like, with the ones that get recommended a lot. I'll, like, take ones from the list and just, like, mass delete. Um, thank you for resubscribing, my friend. I appreciate you so much. Oh, Christ, we were, like, so fucking close to the sub goal. That is so exciting. Holy shit. Um, I think they mean Ja'al. Yeah. Hmm. Ba, ba, ba. Ah, ah. This bitch, right? That looks like it has a cap for a head. I know it doesn't, but it does look like it. Also, recent subscriber, if you would like me to rate a monster of yours since you have just subscribed, um, if someone does a sub or 500 bits or $5, I will rate a monster of theirs. So if you would like me to rate a monster of yours, have at it in the chat and let me know. I can see the appeal. Thank you for the gift sub, King Or. Holy shit. We're over the goal. We're over the goal. Holy shit. King or and Sonya at the exact same time. Holy shit. Are y'all like competing? Are y'all competing? <laughs> Are y'all fucking competing? <laughs> okay. So I'm following back the three most recent subs on TikTok. So that would be who? Sonya, King or, and what is that? So, Sug Hope, Sug Hopeman, Sug Hope, I don't know how to say that. I'm so sorry. Um, so let me know what your TikTok username is and I will follow you back. Ba, ba, da, ba, 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 ba. Oh, I did already follow you back. You're right. You just tend to do this a lot, don't you, my friend? Okay, so Sonya. I'll be Local Phantom then. Do I already follow Local Phantom? I feel like I do. Otherwise, it would be Hey, it's Val. Steve is, has access to every email that emails him. And imagine getting an email from somebody like Coochie Gripper 3000. Listen. Some of these are fascinating. And no, Zach, I haven't gotten to rate yours yet. What is it? It wasn't like the rake, something like that. I haven't gotten to rate that one yet. Um, what can I say? I like to reach goals. Juliet also subscribed. Thank you so much. Holy shit. So a lot of people just subscribed. So I probably should have been keeping notes, huh? Where's my little notebook? Okay. Stream notes. There we go. Okay. Bill Cypher fan 207. Miriam from Miriam. How do you say that? Oh shit. Same name over here. Same name over here, Sonia Chan 03, and for the monster rate. This guy is more like human, but Raiden, Jack from Metal Gear Rising, gets me to places only Satan knows. Okay. Oh, this is fun. Very green, which I. Why is that outfit so slutty? Wait, this outfit is really slutty, and for what? Okay, I can see the appeal. I can see the appeal. I wasn't sure at first because I didn't really like the face, but this, like, slutty little fit is really getting me. That's a six. I would do a little bit of flirting with this bad boy. I really would. It does look a little bit like Frieza, huh? Yeah, no, I can see the appeal. Duh, duh. Damn, I should do I should do monster fucker streams more because y'all are going fucking bonkers for it today, huh? You get a six. 
it's a little human, but it is also green and it's got a weird ass body. So I'm letting it, I'm letting it slide. Um, and Sonya, Raiden Jack from Metal Gear Rising. Guess who to play this? Only Satan knows. And Juliet 301. You can also, uh, there we go. If you sub, what happens? So, uh, if you have a monster crush that you would like me to rate, I can go ahead and rate them for you. This looks kind of just like a boy, but, well, that's a lot of metal for that to just be a boy. Again, with the slutty little fit. That's a fucking thong with strap. Okay. Okay, girly. Um, no, King Or, you do not have to come up with another one if you would not like to. You can also pass it on to somebody else. You can also forward it to someone. This one's kind of fun. The... <sighs> no, I'm interested. I feel like this one's a five, mainly because, like, I, I'm not, like, overwhelmed. But I am intrigued. You know what I mean? They have to be non-human. So, they don't necessarily just have to be monsters, they do just have to be non-human. Stevie forgot the best part to being a sub. You do also get the delightful little emotes. Okay, so Sonya, I followed you back. I have already followed King Or back. Um, I believe it'd be... Who next? Juliet, I can follow you back. Um, and also Sug Hopeman, if you're still in here, I can also follow you back. Uh, oh, he's got a hot voice, huh? Submit an email a while ago about Ultron from Avengers Age of Ultron. He should be on the list because you will never fucking believe. Ultron was the very first monster I ever raided. And Ultron was the one... Why isn't he on here? Oh! Because the person who made the list didn't realize that was the first one. This was the first monster I ever raided. It launched the entire series. Like, the, the whole fucking series. Hold on. Videos, where is it? Bah, bah. Christ, I have a lot of VODs up. Da, ba, 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 da, ba, ba, ba. Where is it? MTT News. Stevie and the Monster Fuckers. There we go. Oh, but I had a fat crush on fucking Ultron whenever this movie came out. I'm setting up a new Google form. Tell me what your mechanical crushes are and I'll rate them. I just posted this like 10 minutes ago. Y'all work fast. So that does was vision it. Count, I guess because he's made out of vibranium. It was literally. He does count. It won't pause it. Okay, there we go. It was literally just mechanical crushes. Like it was going to be like robot crushes and then it turned into non-human crushes. But then monster fuckers had such a ring to it that I kept going with it. So... Ultron was the first one that I ever was attracted to, although you are correct in saying I don't think I ever gave it, or gave him rather, an official rating. Ooh. Oh, you're right. No, my voice has dropped a lot, huh? That is very, very nice to think. Because that was back in like, oh Christ, what, January, February? It was ages ago. Yeah. No, you're right. I, I technically never rated him. So I will go ahead and do that now. Man, for the first ever, I feel like I should have rated him ages ago. Hmm. I don't think I can make out with him, but he would absolutely bang the shit out of me. I feel like it'd be very corruptive, very destructive. And I just think that sounds like a good time. You know what I mean? Um, I feel like I'd have to rate him a 10 because he was the first, but I mean, at least an 8. User here is the same as my TikTok. Perfect. I love when y'all have, like, consistent brands. <laughs> there we go. Following you back, bestie. Um, followed Sonya. Followed Sug. Juliet. What was yours? I don't think I followed you back yet either. Okay.
Fucking, hold on. I need to go back up. Pretty Princess, I didn't see your, your message of Stevie after saying he'd get his guts rearranged by a demon. Eh. <laughs> My therapist would love you. Cry, Zach, you're horrible. Um, it would be loving, but it would be good. He had access to the entire internet. Oh. That's an idea. I know that bitch is good. Ugh. I just know that bitch is good. Mm. Yes. Ah, Lemon Chan has redeemed. Please, sir. Any spare subs? Any spare subs for poor orphan boy? Any at all? Thank you very much, sir. <laughs> it gets harder to do with every passing day. Um, I am giving Ultron. No, I'm not a fucking idiot. I'm giving Ultron a ten. Who am I kidding? Who am I fucking kidding? Okay. So, I'm about to... Made my decision, by the way. A successful man with his own home, his own business, and a single-handedly fighting style is a symbol of the patriarchy. Skeletor from He-Man, Masters of the Universe. Skeletor, uh, uh, the old governor from my state, Rick Scott, we used to joke that he looked like Skeletor. Hold on. I've got to show you. I've got to fucking show you. God, he sucks so bad. I think he's in the Senate now. He's a dickhead. Look at this piece of shit. Look at this... Look at this fucking piece of shit. Look at this jackass. Awful. Fucking dickhead. Um, and then here's Skeletor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, that brings me joy. Um, Christ God. Ironically, very similar social policies, but don't insult Skeletor. <laughs> don't do it. The fact that all of you are defending Skeletor. Incredible. Just incredible. Okay. So, if anyone has any last donations, bits, subs, anything like that, Rebel Voices are sexy, Raiden and Ultron Robot have the voices, voices who get me. Sexy Raiden and Ultron have the voices who gets me wet. No, you're right. You are right. Stevie, you're in Florida, right? Isn't Ron running for 2024 president? Oh, yeah. Oh, I don't know about the slogan. He's such a piece of shit. Oh, God, he's a piece of shit. I fucking hate Ron DeSantis. Um, every time his name comes up, I literally just call him, like, super racist Ron DeSantis because he is. He sucks. Anyway, but I digress. Anyway, rate the governor like a negative 12. That man's not a human. Honest to God. Um, if anyone wants to get any last donations and anything like that, any last recommendations, those are slime balls, dude. What the fuck is... Okay. Okay. I don't know what's happening in there. So, <laughs> otherwise I am going to go ahead and pivot. Um, slime... I literally don't know what you're talking about. I'm deeply confused. Although, someone did recommend that robot bitch from Slime Rancher last week, which was very confusing. So, there's that. Bob from Slime Rancher. Listen, I won't rate it because there were no donos, but I will take a look at it. And I will judge you, just so you know. Okay. Um, yeah, so... That's just... That's just blobs, huh? Yeah, that's just blobs. No, that's a hard no. Um, let me see, Sonya. What was yours again? Raiden, Jack. Oh, that was it. What did I rate him? Oh, I didn't rate it yet. Oh, fuck. That was the one with the human head but the robot body, and you did say it had a voice, so I am gonna go ahead and look back at that bad boy real quick. Um, yeah, Doctor Strange's cape was a weird one. I forgot that I rated that. I, I, I very much forgot that I rated that. Yeah. Um... Okay. Let's see what this bad boy sounds like. Your team deserves credit as well. Mr. Lightning Bolt. Is that him? Is that him? Just doing our job, Mr. Prime Minister. Oh, he sounds like a twink. I must but admit, I once thought of groups like yours as Opportunists. Also, Twitch, I would like to admit that war. I too am a twink. Perhaps I'm not judging this in any way. Private military companies. We prefer private security providers, sir. 
He does remind me of John. Most Glenn. of Maverick's contracts do focus on security. Yes, well, the security. Can... Yeah. So is this a human, or? Oh God damn it! That's a fucking demo. Um. Never mind. This was a random person. So let me, let me get this straight. Is this a human or not? Because if it is, this is a problem. Um, Metal Gear voice lines. He does basically have a psycho mode based on Jack the Ripper. Hmm. Oh, is it this bitch? Wait, Jack the Ripper. Oh. My name is Monsoon. Of the winds okay. of destruction. Okay, I hear you. Now yeah. Go. I guessed as much. He's just a little guy in a suit. It does remind me of Chainsaw Man, and his voice does sound the same either way. Um, <sighs> Raiden is a human. He's kind of part machine, but he's still human. <sighs> I don't know that I can... I've rated people with like robot parts before the idea generally is how close to human they look yeah i don't love the voice either but i don't want to discount him but hmm. that's true bucky barnes is part machine raiden is close to robocop no raiden raiden is just like machine from chin down so that's why i'm kind of partial to letting him slide um, I was intrigued. This is going to be a four. Vague amount of intrigue here. But I'm really not totally captivated. Um, which is sad. Because I really wanted to be. What if someone submitted a ghost in a human body too close? Yeah, if it still looks human, I'm still probably not going to count it, unfortunately. His lower jaw is metal. That's pretty much it. Hmm. You know, me not knowing the lore to all these video games is starting to become a problem. Okay, so, <laughs> let me see. You know, I am going to continue my list uh, on Thursday. Damn, y'all, I didn't hard I got six in on my list, and then I did a fucking billion of y'all's. I can hardly complain. That is a fuck ton of submissions, which I do appreciate, as always. God, I've missed doing this segment. I love it very much. Um, hey, delusions. What the fuck? <laughs> That's a horrible thing to say. Okay. Like I said, I'm going to go on break, and then I am going to come on back, and I am going to start up Dial Town, which is pretty much my my current favorite game. I'm going to skip this song, though. Fuck this. This is thrilling. Okay. Go get some water. Go get a snack. Don't go anywhere. I will be right back. Uh, we're going to play a very nihilistic and very delightful dating sim. I love ya. Be right back. 